they still call Mauer Park Mauer Park? There are no trees and there are no walls. They should be calling it place to buy drugs in Prenzlauerberg. No. Someday. Someday. Hi guys, this is the Bad Jokes Battle again, the show where we ask two good comedians to write bad jokes and compete who's are funnier. This week we are filming in Mauer Park because it still exists. Also, because both of our comedians live here. Two hilarious Brexit victims, Dizzy Be High versus Jules Oaks. Let's battle! Hey Dizzy, just you wait. I'm gonna fucking destroy you, man. See this trash can? All of my jokes belong right the fuck in here. They are so bad. They're so bad, you're not gonna believe it. They're so bad, I feel shamed. I feel more ashamed of these jokes than I've ever felt of anything. And I was raised Catholic, motherfucker. I'm so punny, I'm so funny. Yeah, you just better believe it. I'm gonna make you weep. When you hear my puns, you're gonna crawl over and you're gonna feel like you're being eaten up inside. That's how bad they are. So one, one, two, two three. Oh no! Yeah. Oh, no, oh, no, you didn't. You just went. No, 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 no. I'm cheating already. I'm cheating already. No, no. One, two, three. Yeah, yeah. Right. One, two, three. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Good. I didn't want to go first anyway. So. That was a legit win. So I was doing the dishes the other day. I was trying to clean a really dirty pan. My boyfriend came in and he said, uh, "That's not working. You need to be more abrasive." So I said, "Fuck off, you dickhead." <laughs> uh, I like that. Only because it's violent. Uh, when I was first asked to do this competition, I actually didn't write any puns. I wrote a load of jokes. I wrote ten of them. No pun intended. Nice. <laughs> yeah, very good. Thank you. Uh, cool. All right. Uh, when I was a kid, uh, my dad used to drag the whole family on these really dull sailing trips. Everyone fucking hated them. We'd get to the boat and he'd be like, all aboard. And I was like, well, let's do something else then. <laughs> There's a, a girlfriend I used to go out with. She was used to smoke in bed. Uh, one time, like the fire, it, like dropped and it caught a knickers on fire. And she was like on fire here in the crotch, and she was like there trying to pat it out. She was there for about five minutes, and I just took a glass of water and I threw it over her. And I said, "If you need to put a fire out quickly, don't beat about the bush." Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I, uh, if it weren't so cold, I would, take, <laughs> I would take my hat off to you. How do you remove a flashlight from a butthole? I don't know. How do you remove a flashlight from a butthole? I wish I knew. <laughs> <laughs> I was in um, I'm very, very hot this summer. found it very, very muggy. I had my phone stolen off me four times. I want to say it again. It's been very, it's been very muggy this summer. I had my phone stolen off me four times. Oh, uh, so I wasn't, did it too pay quick. wasn't I did it paying too quick. attention. I know. See, yeah, if you blink, you miss it. You blink, you miss me. it. I think pro-life is a very misleading term because I know loads of people who've had kids and none of them have got a life. <laughs> That's funny and it's true. <laughs> <laughs> right? I was at a pancake festival the other day with my wife. Well, there was, a, another, there was this, another stand and he was selling these Coca-Cola pancakes. The flattest pancake I've ever tasted. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 that one. Drum. You that one, that one yeah. hurt. Last week, I, uh, I took a balloon over to a friend's baby shower. In hindsight, it would have been easier to drive. <laughs> <laughs> That's a real, I, I'm ashamed of myself for that one. I thought Instagram was a really fast drug dealer. Oh, nice. Yeah, I, uh, I found a leak under my kitchen sink the other day. Really jazzed up my soup. <laughs> Yeah, this pancake festival was so great. There was a there was a guy, and I don't know, he must have been there for like not slept the whole time, and like until like today, because he was just fast asleep. There he was. He was like doing the pancake, like tossing and turning while he's sleeping. Yeah. Nice, very nice. I added some beets to a salad the other day. It was like it's mm -hmm, salad, it's mm -hmm, salad. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so I'll finish, I'll finish this pancake story off then I don't go anymore because like, it, was, it was really nice and we ate lots and lots of pancakes but when we were at the last pancake stand and my wife got out a wallet to go and pay, she couldn't find the wallet and I said to her, can you remember like uh, which pancake store we like left at and she couldn't remember so we had to retrace our crepes. 
I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yeah. He locked up for that, he locked up. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah! Boom! In your face! And what is your favorite bad joke of this battle? Let us know in the comments. Or write your own bad joke and we'll see if it's funny. We'll be back soon with different comedians and more bad jokes. Like, tweet, share, sub, whatever guys. We'll see you soon.